What's up, YouTube? It's Sauce Outdoor Life. Today, we're going to do something special. I've got a special surprise that we done Sunday. So stick around, and we'll see you. Uh, right now, we're spending time with little Miss Kinley. She actually decided to be awake today with all of her five million toys. I don't know how you made this big of a mess. What you doing, Kinley? What is it? You need to say hi? You need to say hi? You need to say hi. That was code for go subscribe right now. <laughs> but I'm about to have to put her down and we'll get into this, the real meat and taters of this video. So y'all stick around. All right. So remember when I said that we had a big accident in yesterday's video about our old chicken pen that we were trying to make into a chicken pen well we had a bunch of rain Saturday night and this was the result and I was trying to drain the water out and see if I couldn't just snap these back in place but unfortunately the whales broke on every bit of this thing so you may be asking, well, Kevin, where are you going to put the chickens? Well, we we come up with a solution. Uh, I'm just glad no chickens were in there when this decided to collapse. It is really hot out here. God, feels good. But we come up with a solution yesterday, or Sunday and decided you know i love chickens i've always wanted chickens why not just get a good chicken coop so that's what we did we got a real chicken coop and i wanted a walk-in this wasn't the one i was actually trying to find this was a little more expensive but Ow. It's considered a walk-in. I'm 5'10", and I can barely stand up in here. I'm having to crouch. But, this is a good chicken coop. This one houses 20 chickens, whereas the one I was looking at only houses, I believe it was 15. So, we can get five more chickens in here. And, yeah, nothing really can get in here. I do have to put some stuff around the bottom of this to make it to where no critters can get in there. Can't burrow in there or anything like that. But they have a sliding door. We can close that off. And for their nest... I haven't got it set up yet, but yeah. So I'm really impressed with it. It the reason why we did not film us putting this together for somebody that wanted to know how to put one of these together or anything like that was because we were battling a thunderstorm. Um, for Sunday, right after we got it got it back home we could see off to the west of us a storm was brewing in so at one point we actually had to run inside the house because we were getting soaking wet the girls had already wimped out and went back inside while me and Herschel were out here still in the rain working on it but after it calmed down a little bit 
Well, we did get it back. We got it all together. I think it took about an hour and a half to put this thing together. And this is, the, I believe it's called the Chicken Resort. We got it from Tractor Supply. And overall, I'm impressed with it. The only thing I didn't like is you have to have a level ground. And that's one thing about our property. Nothing on this land is level. Except for our house. But none of the land is actually level. And it's awful. Like our, our whole land is just a giant hill. So I will say that the old chicken coop new chicken coop a lot better I can control that one a lot more and I ain't got to worry about that ever again so I think that's going to be a really good thing we're going to go get some chickens hopefully this Friday if the guy that we know locally goes and gets them he's an elder man so Hopefully, he feels like going and getting them. I think he goes down to South Alabama to get them. Uh, I wish I knew what was trying to get in this. We left this open for the kayaks. Which we're going to do some filming this year with them. Hadn't got them out. Uh, mine leaks. It's always leaked. Mine always had water pour in it. And Bernice doesn't. I don't understand that. Why would one leak and the other one not? Because they're the exact same brand, brought them the exact same day. Just gonna see how much water we've got in the boat. I forgot to put the tarp on it. That's stupid on me. Oh, we got a little bit. Let's see if we can't get the bills pump. At least run it for a minute. Da, 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 da. I've got to still order a prop. I keep forgetting to do that. He's been in my boxes. That's good. I've got to go fishing. I may go this weekend. Nope, can't go this weekend. I may go Friday. Oh. But I've got Kenley's pageant this Saturday, so can't go fishing Saturday at all. She's going to be in a beauty pageant. And if you're still new to this channel, hit that subscribe button, like, comment on our videos. Uh, let us know in the comments down below what you want to see. You want to see more chicken stuff or hopefully we can get out and do some more fishing but we'll see y'all in the next video goodbye